So we're constantly getting tons of videos uploaded to wingsound.com by our user community, and here's some that we think you just gotta see. And remember, you could always upload your own by visiting wingsound.com. The Happy Viking shows us how to set up Serato Scratch Live. So as you can see, there's one with line, and it's the output. So I'll just set that box aside. Then I take my other end. Now remember, this is not from the CD player, this is from Serato. Okay? And I'm just going to plug it in to a mixer. See? Alright, now, here's the Serato box. Here's my USB cable. It looks kind of like this. Now watch, look at all you do. Plug it in. Houston Singletary explains how to convert audio to MIDI in Ableton. Hi everybody, Houston Singletary. I'm going to take you through and show you how we can convert MIDI to audio. It's really quick, very convenient. The other thing that I like about it is I can actually freeze it, convert it to audio, and then do some really interesting things with warping effects and things like that once it's audio. Now we'll simply make a brand new audio track. Pops up there to the right, and we'll simply drag our MIDI clip into the audio track. And it's its own audio clip with the effects included. Really, really cool stuff. If I undo that, drag that over, keep a nice copy there. Home Studio Corner demonstrates how to cover track bleed using Logic Studio. Okay, so as you can hear, it's definitely electric guitar, but it's very clean, and in the right with the right mix could pass as that final chord on acoustic. So what I ended up doing in the song is I had this set right about here to where you can hear the acoustic, the final note, but it fades out pretty quickly, as you can see here. I'll zoom in there. So it fades out rather quickly, and then this fades in at the same spot, and for the rest of the song, you're listening to this electric sustaining that note as opposed to this acoustic. So let's take a listen to that. We'll listen to just those two by themselves and I'll play the whole mix. So we've got acoustic and the electric. Hey, thanks so much for watching. We really hope you enjoyed those videos. And don't forget to check out the new Wing Sound podcast available now on iTunes. You'll be able to keep up to date with the latest music production videos and tutorials coming out of wingsound.com. Plus, you can take it with you on the go, so it's great. That's great. And remember, you could always find us on Twitter, at Wingsound. And any questions you guys have, you could always hit us up directly at MattelWingsound.com. Rick at Wingsound.com. And remember, for more music production tutorials like these, visit Wingsound.com, the new social video network for audio creatives.